Hello guys, this is Deathdealer and welcome to another Redstone tutorial. In this one we're going to be taking a look at the hidden piston door that utilises a double piston extender. Here is how it works, so this is it opening, pretty good, and this is it closing. This is a pretty simple circuit and well, yeah it can be used for many different things, so let's go on to the tutorial. Okay, so to get started what you're going to need is an 8x8 area and first of all we're going to start by placing a temporary block on the third block and from the front and removing the temporary block. This will be your redstone input. Next we're going to work on the circuit that will be extending the pistons out. So place two blocks like so with two repeaters both on full delay. Excellent. Block up like so with a piece of redstone dust on top. Now you may wish to place some temporary blocks so you can staircase up with some half slabs like so and place some redstone dust on them as well. Next place four blocks like so and then three blocks off in this direction. Now you'll want to place a redstone repeater here, leave it on one tick delay. Place another repeater here on 2 ticks delay and place another repeater here on full delay. The remainder of the blocks can have redstone dust. Now you may wish to place in the pistons that will be the double extenders. So if you place a piston in this position and then one in front and the same on top and you may wish to place the block that you want to extend out. Now this would be a good time to test your circuit so far and it should do this. And if you turn it off, it should do that. So it's working this far. Okay, so next we're going to be working on the piston retraction section of this redstone circuit. And we're going to be using the yellow block just to indicate what this circuit does. So if you place a block down here next to your input with a redstone repeater on default delay, place a temporary block there and a normal block there with a redstone torch on top of it. This will act as an OK. Next, go to place another block with a repeater set on full delay that will go into a block with a redstone torch on top. Now, you'll want to place blocks on either side, both with redstone dust on top. Next, go to place another block, place the blocks like so, and yeah, this is what the circuit will look like. And now, you may wish to start placing in your pistons because once we hook up the remainder of the circuit you won't be able to get in here very easily. Okay so this next circuit will send another pulse through the repeaters which will retract the double piston extender. So to get started we're going to place three blocks like so, this one with redstone dust, this one with a repeater set on full delay with another piece of redstone dust on top of this block. Next we're going to bring the blocks up and come across by three blocks with redstone dust on each of these as well. We're going to continue bringing the circuit up by two blocks and we're going to place blocks like so. With the redstone dust here, a repeater set on full delay, a redstone torch, a block here with a repeater set on full delay. Okay guys, so that is the circuit complete. So you may wish to test your circuit by simply pulling this lever, that is the retraction and the, well, yeah, this is the way it should look. Now a few things to take note of, most of these air blocks in here you want to leave as air blocks apart from these ones in here, so you may wish to place a floor which I would recommend using half slabs to avoid any strange bud powering or such. These blocks here you need to keep empty as well because if this torch is on and the pistons have been retracted, well you're going to have these pistons retracting when they're in this position which will completely mess up your wall, which you really don't want. Okay guys, that is this circuit now complete. And well, if you were confused by this tutorial you can find a world download down in the description below where you can follow this thing block for block. which. I would recommend downloading anyway because you may want to reference it at some point in the near future. 
But guys, I'm afraid that is it for today. So as always, if you like this video, please make sure to hit that like button. And if you really enjoyed it and want to see more, make sure to subscribe. Thank you for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys next time.